Hey guys, how's it going? Yuri here. I want to show you what you can do with a tennis ball and a kettlebell to open up your psoas, one of the muscles that makes up your hip flexor, so you can get more mobility through your hips and reduce back pain. So this is a bit of a, an interesting exercise. Learn this one from Kelly Starrett and give it a shot. If you've got a kettlebell, awesome. If not, then you can't do it. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna find your psoas and how you're gonna do that is you're gonna lay down and you're gonna take your hand and you're just gonna kinda dig it onto the side of your abdominal wall here. So just where you feel those abdominals, just to the side of that, that is your psoas right in there. And as the dogs come on over and try to lick me, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the tennis ball and we're gonna place it right in that little nook there. As you press down, you can feel the psoas, okay? Now we're gonna add a bit of pressure by putting the kettlebell on top. Now again, don't try this at home unless you really want to, but we're gonna use the kettlebell to get right on top of that ball and we're just gonna let it sit there, okay? That's pressure. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up that psoas. We're just gonna move the leg around. Guys, guys, guys. We're gonna move the leg through different ranges of motion and we're just gonna get that psoas moving and the pressure is gonna to help to break up some of those adhesions in that area. So I'm not moving the kettlebell necessarily or the ball, but I'm moving my psoas by moving my leg around it. Okay? So you can squeeze the glute, relax the glute. Squeeze the glute, relax the glute. Move the leg through different ranges of motion to really open that area up. And that's as simple as it needs to be. Okay, so you can do a couple minutes on one side, a couple minutes on the other. And again, that psoas is just on the side of the abdominal wall. So just in here, you wanna dig your finger right into the side there, right in there, okay? Right into this hole, into this crevice, right through there. That's where you're gonna find your psoas. It's right in this, come on, dig right in there. Once you feel that spot where it's like, oh, that, that feels kind of uncomfortable, that's the psoas. And the psoas originates in your lumbar spine. It comes right through your hips and then meets your iliacus to form your hip flexors. So a lot of times when we have back pain, it's due to the psoas, which is pulling too much in the lower back. So this exercise is gonna help loosen that up and open that tough to really, that psoas is very tough to stretch, okay? So we're gonna use this tennis ball and the kettlebell to open that up and to lengthen that muscle. Cool, give it a shot if you want. It's a really nifty little trick and uh, let me know how it goes in the comments. You can join me at the blog, link for that is below and I'll see you in the next video.